Either we move forward on the path of diplomacy and seize this chance to block Iran's path to a nuclear weapon, or we turn down a more dangerous path leading to a far less certain and riskier future. That's why I support this deal. I support it as part of a larger strategy toward Iran. By now, the outcome in Congress is no longer in much doubt, so we've got to start looking ahead to what comes next, enforcing the deal, deterring Iran and its proxies, and strengthening our allies. These will be my goals as president, and today I want to talk about how I would achieve them. Let me start by saying I understand the skepticism so many feel about Iran. I, too, am deeply concerned about Iranian aggression and the need to confront it. It's a ruthless, brutal regime that has the blood of Americans, many others, including its own people, on its hands. Its political rally, rallies resound with cries of death to America. Its leaders talk about wiping Israel off the face of the map, most recently just yesterday, and foment terror against it. There is absolutely no reason to trust Iran. 